swing this one, but a good challenge Ooh. ensues. A booming clear. Not able to get there in time. Fought for a minute. Good come back from oh, There it is. Super. You saw before you even have to Working in the broadcast industry, it's quite exhilarating. There's no do-overs. You cannot go back and fix that mistake in post like you can in pre-recorded videos. It has a very similar aspect to it as musical performance. Six, five, four, three, ready, host, two, one, and Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you're from. Viva la Rocket League! Hi, my name is Koji Kameda, and I am a broadcast director. I started out as a nano engineering major. I pursued that for four years before I realized I was pulling my hair out trying to understand things that I did not care about. I found out that there was a community of people in San Diego that played this game, Super Smash Brothers. There was not a lot of competitive infrastructure, and there was not a lot of coverage for said lack of infrastructure. So I kind of put two and two together and decided to start my own stream. I've learned to delegate. While it is very fulfilling, being a one-man team is also backbreaking. Quite frankly, the caliber of something one person can produce is a ceiling when it comes to that sort of a thing. There's a reason why football productions have hundreds of people on their production team. There were two broadcasts I was a part of last year, the Fortnite World Cup and the Apex Legends ESPN EXP Invitational, and both of them were nominated for a Sports Emmys Award for Outstanding Esports Coverage. I was very proud to be a part of both of those shows. It was something else. Beefy boy. <laughs> I decided to build a new computer because I was hitting the limits of my old unit's capabilities. I did not have nearly enough processing power to be able to handle the kind of graphics and videos I like to display on broadcast. I elected to go with the Intel i9-10980XE. It features 18 cores, which is the most number of cores in Intel's i9 suite lineup, and plays very well with the motherboard I picked out, which features seven PCIe slots. Those allow for video graphics card expansions, output cards, things that are very necessary for broadcast. What's that? Ooh. We'll see how Levens can respond, but it's Pan bringing you back out towards his corner, and we'll try to swing this one, but a good challenge Ooh. ensues. A booming clear, not able to get there in time. Thought for a minute, Open here comes the follow-up, and there it is, Super. You saw before it even happened. Talk about that. RLCS is uh, called the Rocket League Championship Series. It's an international tournament that runs individual regions. This weekend happens to be the majors for the RLCS. They're running three different divisions this weekend. South America, Europe, and North America. Great control from Tander to slow that down at the last second and get that under flip to make sure he gets that angle down. He was coming in an upward. Every broadcast has the chance to be a dumpster fire. It's just a matter of learning how to adapt and be a better firefighter. It's often long hours, it's often very tiring, and there's often a lot of things that you'll work tirelessly on, and it'll just never end up making its way to air. Behind the scenes, there's we got a production chat just moving, moving all the time to make sure they're delivering the best Rocket League to you guys. But at the end of the day, I want to put on a cool show, whatever that entails, whether it's running a Fortnite World Cup, a Super Bowl, or just a Twitch stream. <laughs> On behalf of all the casters here, all those guys behind the scenes making all this magic work. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you soon. It's a lot of fun to go in and craft something and to have everyone look at it and just have a great time.